World War III active North Korea ready to carry out a nuclear test at any time. The National Intelligence Service, NIS, South Korea's spy agency, has given the chilling warning that the Hermit Kingdom is persisting with its efforts to start World War III. The NIS said the North will carry out an additional nuclear test and continue to push for the development of miniaturized, diversified nuclear warheads. The South Korean agency stated that increased activity around a research facility in Pyongyang show that despot leader Kim Jong-un is gearing up to launch another world provocation for the first time since September. The warnings of another impending nuclear test from the isolationist state come as Donald Trump conducts his tour of Asia, where he is set to discuss the future of North Korea with numerous world leaders. The president recently landed in Japan and immediately reopened his war of words with Kim Jong-un, calling him a dictator and warning he underestimated U.S. resolve at his peril. The U.S. president began a 12-day trip to Asia on Sunday by telling reporters on Air Force One that Pyongyang would figure prominently in discussions during the visit. After arriving at Yokota Air Base, just west of Tokyo, Mr. Trump told U.S. and Japanese troops, no dictator, no regime, no nation should ever underestimate American resolve. Every once in a while, in the past, they underestimated us. It was not pleasant for them, was it? North Korea's recent actions, including several missiles that flew over Japan and Pyongyang's sixth and largest nuclear test, have raised the stakes in the most critical international challenge of Trump's presidency. Recent drills over South Korea by two U.S. strategic bombers have further heightened tensions. Mr. Trump said, we will never yield, never waver and never falter in defense of our freedom. He told reporters earlier on Air Force One that a decision would be made soon on whether to add reclusive North Korea to a list of state sponsors of terrorism. The president said his administration planned to take a different approach after years of what he termed total weakness. He added, we want to get it solved. It's a big problem for our country and the world, and we want to get it solved. In an apparent attempt to distinguish between North Korea's leadership and ordinary people, he said he thought North Koreans were great people. Trump went on, and I hope it all works out for everybody.